Welcome back to the Abundant Harvest Homestead. I'm Papa Pepper. Periodically, since we started this YouTube channel, companies reach out to us to test some of their products. The vast majority of those offers I decline, but this time I accept it, and I've accepted a couple other ones that will be coming up in upcoming videos. This one, a company called Vivor, reached out to me, and they wanted to see if I'd be interested in trying a Vivor demolition hammer. I'm going to open this up. I'm going to do some initial testing today, show you guys that quick, and then I'll put it through some more use and I'll let you know how that worked out before the end of this video. I'm going to try to make it short. Let's get into it. <laughs> yeah. That is massive and solid. I did not expect this to be this big of a machine. Yeah, it's the Vivar demolition hammer. And, uh, Right away, just the size and the feel, I'm impressed. Good ergonomic handle. Um, seems like some decent metal. Good trigger. Looks like you can lock it in place. They actually even sent safety glasses, and I, I wasn't sure if they were gonna send me a chisel. And that's a decent chisel. I wasn't sure if they were gonna send any chisel bits, but I got a nice flat and a nice point. They also sent safety glasses, very cool, and gloves. So this is a hammer, not a drill, and uh, I've got some concrete here. I could use some smaller pieces of this, so we're gonna see how it works for our initial test. I guess now let's plug it in and go. That split that really easy. Now this is only just shy of three inch thick and there was nothing you know, under it, but wow, that went pretty easy. Let's try another one. Crazy thing is I just got a generator and I've got a bunch of big concrete that I wanted to split to be able to use in smaller pieces. Um, wow, this is gonna be perfect for that. So far that spike works amazing. I'm gonna switch out and we'll try the, uh, the chisel bit and see how that goes. That is so much quicker. Like if you don't need a, cl a clean cut, that's so much quicker than a concrete saw for sure. I like this. Living in the Ozarks, we also have a lot of large rocks in our soil. And uh, this one here is just too big. I don't want it with all the children running around. My fire, plate, fire pit is right over there. So I'm gonna see if I can bust this up to remove it. Let's test it on some all natural resources.
So yeah, that's gonna be a handy tool around here. So far, so good. So when testing out a product like this, you know, ideally I'd love to take a year to test it out, but uh, you know, if a company is giving you something for free to test out and review, they don't really wanna wait a year for your video to come out. So what I decided, hey, I've got freezing temps, I've got not the best work conditions. If a machine's gonna malfunction, a lot of times when it's cold or freezing, that's when stuff's gonna go wrong, so that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, every time I've taken this thing out of the box and used it, it's worked well, um, but we're gonna put it to a test before I really give you guys a green light or not on what I think of it. Here we go. So overall, would this be worth the price tag? In my opinion, I think yes. Um, I do a number of jobs that involve removing sections of parking lot, stuff like that. Um, I didn't have any of that available during the course of this review. Thankfully, I had some concrete slabs I could bust up and some big natural rock. I like the way it handled. I've used really big jackhammers before that are much bigger than this. Um, they do great. This seems comparable for the size that it is. I like it. Um, got some stuff coming up. I might be able to put it to some more rigorous testing. The first clips here, I use the spike. These ones, last ones, I use the chisel. It did what I wanted to do here. Some of this is going to be repurposed on my property. I just uh, didn't want to carry the big ones down to the property. So this gave me the opportunity to get up here and do that without having to uh, use a sledge. Um, I like it. The Vivor Demolition Hammer, I like it. I'd give it my approval. It's held up well so far, and I like what it's capable of. I'll see you next time. Papa out.